Welcome to my channel. My name is Andreas. Recently, Leia have updated the LoomPad, and with it came an application called Leia Tube that allows you to play streaming video from the internet. And I just thought I'd make you aware of it because it opens up a whole new world of content for LoomPad users. So just to be clear, this is not a special YouTube light field application, nor is it a special Vimeo or Facebook or CNN light field application. This is a light field player in its own right. And uh, that has the advantage that you do not need to have special players uh, for all of these different streaming vendors. You can still use the existing applications that you're used to, that you know how to navigate, and use them simply to pass your stream, once you've found them, onto this generic player. Now at this stage, um, Leia, from what I understand, only support YouTube for this player. But don't let that stop you from trying other applications or websites for that matter. Because if they work, hey, what have you got to lose? So, when you start this app, this is what it looks like. It just gives you instructions. It doesn't actually let you start a video from here. So that's not how to use it. So let's start over. But now, I'm going to simply start the YouTube app instead of the LayerTube app. And from here, I'm going to start a video and now that the video is open, I simply share it with the LayerTube app, like this. And after some initialization, the video starts playing in light field mode. So you can skip back in 5 second intervals, and you can skip forward in 15 second intervals. And you can also navigate the video using the time control, similar to, you know, other video apps that you would be used to. You can increase or decrease the depth level uh, here irrespective of the video source. The type of video is generally auto detected but if the app does get it wrong for some reason you can manually set the type of the video uh, and it will either be a mono uh, regular 2D video or a half or full width SBS, that's side by side video. Uh, it can also be a VR360 or a VR360 that is 3D, that has an above and below uh, version of the VR360. Now these are all formats that you can find on YouTube. Uh, if for some reason Leia does get it wrong, there is a feedback button that allows you to feed back to Leia so that they can make corrections to their detection mechanism. And finally, there's also this back button that takes you back to the calling application, which here happens to be YouTube. So now, let me show you that it's not just YouTube videos, but other videos that you can play as well. Here I'll open up Facebook and navigate to a video. Uh, so for this again we will share the video. Note that I need to press more to get to the Layer Tube app. Uh, now I press Layer Tube and away we go. Now let's open up Vimeo and search for a Vimeo video. I'll pick this one and again press the share button. Select layer tube and again we see the video in its full light field glory. By now I think you're getting the pattern here. Uh, it's simply just a matter of sharing your stream with layer tube. But one more. Let's open up the CNN website in Chrome. Now, long press 
on the video, on the corner here of the video, and select Share. And then do the same as before, and the video plays. There's a second method here as well. Uh, if you select the three dots on the top right corner of the browser and share from here, uh, select Layer Tube, and we can play that video also. So it's the same video again. Thank you for watching, and God bless.